Hey guys, good morning. I was holding my phone when I ran inside the room to have a little cry. I'm just like, okay, great opportunity to show you the other side of things. <sighs> so what was wrong with me, guy? Right? It has been weeks of piling these emotions of a lot of things. They've piled, they've piled, they've piled. Something very small happened and I just lost it. Something I wouldn't have even given a rat ass about. I know you get it. So emotions pile down of you doing a lot and not seeing the results you want. Seriously, I'm seeing very good results, but it's normal to want more. So this feeling is even the least of all the feelings, sir. Eh? The main feeling is having so much want to do, but doing too little. Good. That's the board. I'm trying to also be serious with my YouTube, which is very important to me. I, I was supposed to upload a video on Sunday. I couldn't meet up. I had pro content I needed to make for brands and my personal life too needed some things. I ended up doing a clothing haul, which you guys saw in the other, last vlog, I think. In the night, when I was supposed to be resting from so much, I was not even in the place mentally, but it was in the night, the lighting was not good. I had had this perfect um, um content idea I had for those clo for that try on haul. I even wanted to do more videos to surprise because I really loved the, the clothes. So I really even wanted to go where and beyond for what the brand asked just from my mind because I love the clothes and you know it's the beginning of things for me I understand very much at this stage it's not just about what the brand has to offer me it's an opportunity I have to leverage and work on a logarithm so other opportunities like this can come but I just couldn't do it it was just so much on my plate I was stressing myself and I was not happy with the results and I just broke. It's painful because I feel if I'm focused on YouTube, eh, the kind of mad contents I have in my mind, because I'm a very creative person. Now, if I want to focus on my business too, you can't do everything at once. But again, it is what it is. I'll just find a balance and a way. I just need to re-strategize. I think that's what I need. I want to go to stock up things and it's trying to rain. Very annoying. I may go today. I may not go. I'll see you guys later.
you guys this is what we are working with we have drinks on this side we have items that are stocked whole and we have refills items that are meant to be refilled into various containers so let's do this Dois, com os arquivos, não? This is the deep freezer. I have a meal prep a lot, so I have soups, stew, and party jollof mix that I did myself. Sausages, half yo um, Greek yogurt I was eating. So this is the fridge section. This is what it looks like. My fridge section. So let me take you over. Um, the upper part of your fridge is always the coldest, in case you don't know. So you want to put drinks or stuff that can spoil easily closer to that place. Um, then items that may not readily spoil easily and don't like so much cold should be down, like your vegetables. So here I have my this year i usually put my veggies and i have just cabbage carrots and leftover banana here um th this is where i put all my canned drinks like you guys saw this is many days later inside here i have my apples this bananas it doesn't mean this is what they are permanently made for. I could switch it up anytime. Maybe I don't like the fruit. I don't feel like having apples this week. I could switch it up. I have my berries here with some tissue. And this is my snack container. I have drinks over there. And some drinks and my cat's food. When you open it, you have to keep it refrigerated. So I have it there. Then over here I have items that don't readily spoil 
easily but you want to keep them in the fridge like nutella peanut butter any milk i use leftover i have baking soda here for fridge smells like odor i hate that fridge smell i have empty mason jars for like overnight oats or smoothies i have the sesame oil sweet chili sauce shawarma whatever sweet chili sauce i have my soy sauce here i have this for barbecue or when i'm grilling chicken i have this low calorie <laughs> Um, strawberry house syrup i have ketchup ketchup and i have my apple cider vinegar so that's basically what it looks like in here yeah <laughs> So you guys thank you so much for watching <laughs> don't forget to like share and subscribe and i'll see you next sunday